It's the ISO God Sensei, the greatest on 2K in existence. And look, man, a damn NBA player has exposed NBA 2K24. There's a huge split in between the community, man. And I'm going to go over specific reasons why people left right more and why that casual NPC who's been crying since 2K14 has ruined the game and literally created left right at the meta level. But before we get into that, man, y'all make sure y'all subscribe if you're new, man. Help me hit 275 k point one we are like six subscribers away and make sure you hit that goddamn like button it's free it helps young swan grow now look one of my subscribers sent me this man i believe it's real you know he sent me like group chats all different type of stuff screen recordings all different type of stuff i guess this taylor guy was out there and one of his homies is cool with this nba player he went out there i guess he posted a picture and reposted it on the story with 2k and do say hey that bit good <laughs> NBA player Taylor says, same as last year, different menu and but the gameplay is the same. Okay, is this a W or L to y'all? Do y'all like uh 2K23? Are y'all looking forward to that? Now, Kai Sinat has said this, Duke kind of said this, and someone else who I talked to said this, and someone else who I talked to said this, and them two played the game also so it's like it's looking like we're getting a 2k23 the easiest 2k of all time is being replicated with crossplay damn me personally i don't like that to me this is easily the worst 2k ever y'all let me know y'all's worst 2k ever and yeah, so this guy now look this guy right here tagged me on twitter Okay, by the way, y'all follow me on Twitter right now. Go do it right now and then come back to the video. But he says, the problem with the movement on 2K is that it's so unresponsive. This is true. In the 2K 15 and 16 clips, you can see he's breaking out and chaining certain moves together quickly. In my 23 clip, you'll notice I have to wait till the whole animation plays out to burst out and do another move now this is very true bro okay let's 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 have a look in 2k15 you're, you're you're gonna see what see what i'm talking about right you see how he's jumping back and he can quickly react and train the drip hold on let me mute him you see how he can jump back and do this Kyrie step back right you can jump back and instantly go into other moves and chain other moves this is how the old 2ks were by the way they say these are uh more arcade 2Ks, but it's actually more realistic because nobody's pausing between animations. Basketball is really smooth and quick. Like, is this so OP? Is Does this look OP? No. But the casual NPC crying, thinking it's 2K, allowing people to do certain stuff, but it's really them. They're horrible. Now, look. Let me show you something else. Now look, this is him playing moving, right? Look, is this so OP, guys? It's not. It's not. But look, look how it is in 23. Look, look, look how it is. You see how it jumps back and it's a big pause and just delay? This is all movement. A lot of y'all who wasn't in deep, you don't understand you feel me when someone like me be talking about stuff y'all be talking about someone's talking about nostalgia and no i can talk about 300 plus gameplay related things that are horrible and ruin the game and literally what it's doing look brilliant tweet by the swan this might go over y'all's heads but listen so you can understand okay <laughs> Look, I say people left right more now because that envious side of 2K that cries and got all the other dribble moves that used to be effective nerf. So now they're only for show at the meta level. That's what everyone's complaining about. They don't like the people that play comp playing a certain way. You feel me? The reason in 15 and 16, these 2Ks had unlimited stamina. Why aren't people just spamming left right? They're doing a bunch of different moves. The momentum's very effective. A lot of different moves were very effective. There were different moves that they removed or extremely slowed down and nerfed. So what does this create? It makes people left right because left right's unpatchable. Stop and go is unpatchable. It's like 
that style's been in every 2K, but you didn't have to play like that. You feel me? To be competitive. That's why in these newer 2Ks, people are left riding when they play competition because you have no other choice. You feel me? This is why I keep saying put the old dribble moves in the game and stop slowing them down and nerfing them. You're ruining the game. You're making people left, right more and you're making people cheese harder. You feel me? If you go play 15 or 16, you will see if you play some type of realistic movement or, or 17, if you play, if you're a realistic sim head, you will see that it feels more realistic than these newer delayed 2Ks, bro. <laughs> it's just facts. So this video right here went viral, right? It's, it's going viral on all platforms and whatever. By the way, leaked pro play. I think this is how pro play will actually play. I think it's going to be a whole separate mode, by the way. So this is cool and all, right? There's like no hating for me. This is cool. Like it's dope, right? But if these were the most OP ways to play 2K, I don't think a lot of people realize how broken it would like truly be. Let's let, let's look, right? He's walking up the court. We're going to break it down. We're going to break it down, man. He's walking up the court and he's fading, okay? Anyone with a brain, but I know a lot of casuals, they don't know this. Anyone with like 2K brain, okay? Let, let's say that. They know that fading has been the most broken, easiest thing to do since 2K15 and to be able to compete at the highest level, right? So he's fading, you know, contested fade. And yeah, okay, this is this is all beautiful, man. You know, nice, nice little layup and stuff, you know? But then people want to complain about painting. This ain't really nothing, okay? This, this is all cool. This is dope. You know, fading, like... Look, fading on all these people, but like when a comp dude do it, like it's a problem, right? Listen, you know, this is cool, this is dope. You you see the clips he's showing fading on three people? Look at this. Contested shot. People gotta understand like realistic stuff. It don't really if you try to like make it to where stuff like this is the most optimal way to play and it's not just about getting completely open your game just like becomes broken and horrible like look no like damn this is all clean and lit bro this is lit it's lit okay you know it's nice it's nice it's beautiful it's beautiful. It's beautiful. It's beautiful, man. You know, it's nice. You know, dunk on three people. Let's go, baby. Yeah, shoot that contested fade. So, Badge Plug tweeted out, the 2K community needed these realistic basketball videos coming out. I, I think they're good for the community and stuff, but... I think people lack understanding. The reason people have to play they way, the way that they play is because they're playing higher comp levels of people. You feel me? If you choose not to, you can do a bunch of stuff like this and be successful. I hope one of these guys can actually, like, instead of just short form, like pulling views, I wish one of these guys would be able to pull views um, streaming or making youtube videos and they're like blowing up from their like gameplay you feel me uh i think that would be really dope but it seems like i don't know bro a lot of people for years a lot of the casuals they've been coming at youtubers for being like fake like like as in like portraying a false image of like not being so good and all that right but what y'all don't realize is these people that y'all are praising, it's all again jutsu. Like, it might look like they're way colder than they actually are. If they turned on a stream and tried playing like that, and people would start a stream sniping them and stuff and all that, you would see, like, how they really play. Like, people don't understand that YouTube is highlights. 
You feel me? That's not really their their real bag. So I don't know, man. It seems kind of hypocritical, like, but that post scoring stuff can compete at the highest level. But we've never seen a post score really like blow up on the tube. When when does that happen? Or like like streaming, like they're just hated. You feel me? I don't know. And you know, there's been a lot of people tweeting out that this is what people really want, a uh, realistic uh, style of play and all that, and just by the views that it's getting. And me, man, I think just that type of stuff, it relates to more people that aren't even 2K fans. You feel me? So it's a bigger audience. It's a way bigger audience. It's just like, for instance, uh. The my, there's there's like rebuild channels like people who do all this simulation they be simulating and just talking through it well like scenarios they'll be like i traded damian lillard to the heat like show no gameplay just talking about it 400k views and it's like a glitch on youtube like for some reason a bunch of videos like that pull crazy views so it's like the audience always been there but people just don't post that stuff. I think people are now posting it, so now you can see, but there are plenty of channels who do a lot of my career and they have huge audience, but it's not from gameplay. It's more from a scenario type of thing, you know? I don't know, but yeah, that stuff has always pulled views, bro. Like, do, do your research, man. Steezo tweet out, stop saying I'm hating on sim players. If y'all want to go to the wreck and role play Michael Jordan for Twitter likes, other than trolling y'all for interactions, we do not care laughing my ass off respectfully. Nobody outside of old heads or anybody that cares about winning is converting to that play style. Took y'all crying to the devs for years to nerf every other style possible to finally be in the conversation. I don't, I don't, I don't think this is true, bro. I just think they've been so lazy that they never posted that type of stuff. I feel like if they played these other games and posted that type of stuff, it would get the same amount of views, bro. If not better, because they could really be shifty and be able to compete in like better levels because you didn't have to left right to be effective. But then he said, dribblers and meta slash comp been eating for years and we're still eating and we'll continue to eat, humble yourselves. Yeah, they, they are getting kind of arrogant and stuff, but it's like, if, you, if you're playing in fantasy land, like you can do a lot of different stuff. Like I think I mostly play like a, a a realistic person besides when I want to have a little fun every now and then I don't I don't I don't know man it's like if you look at the 2k league why, why do you think they have to play like that bro if you look at the stage why do you think they have to play like that because the envious NPC done nerfed all the other dribble moves that are effective so now they have to play that way they can't do no realistic style and like be effective bro it's just not gonna work uh versus like players with like their badges and that know how to play the game it's, it's just not gonna work so like y'all are creating a 2k at the meta level that y'all don't like even though y'all y'all are never gonna play these guys but it's like bro some of y'all just have to stop crying and you have to get better bro you hurting yourself more than you hurting meta guys. Meta guys are always going to adapt, man. That That's just how it, how it goes, man. History repeats itself, and that's just how it goes. But yeah, man, y'all let me know how y'all feel about this. Y'all make sure y'all check out my other 2K24 videos. But hey, hey, here we go again. Yeah. Here, here we go again. People talking this, but when this hit the fan, everything I'm at made me. Now break it down. Yo, off the top of the dome, dome.